popular Yoruba activist, Sunday Igbowo, who is currently fighting insecurity in the southwest part of Nigeria. The struggle started after the death of a popular doctor, Fatai Aborodi, of the 11th, on the 11th of December 2020. The doctor was said to have a very sound academic qualification after he had studied and received a PhD abroad. After so many years of being a successful doctor abroad, he decided to come home and establish a farm for himself and his farm crops are doing well. On one fateful day, he decided to go to his farm as usual but met some Fulani Hesme on his farm whose cow are uh, eating his crops. He made an attempt to stop them and question them for eating his farm crops which led to his sudden death. It was reported that the doctor got slain by the Fulani Hesme for confronting them of eating his crops. After they had left, they tried rushing him to the nearest hospital if he could still survive the injury he had sustained, but all failed. His death was the reason what led to the fight between Sunday Bo and the bad Fulani Hesme in the southwest state. According to several interviews granted by the popular Yoruba activist, he said, I can not open my eyes and watch Fulani Hesme come and destroy our land and kill our families and friends all in the name of grazing their cow. But recently, the popular Fuji musician's daughter, K1 the Ultimate, whose name is Dami Masha, posted on a Snapchat story to attack those sending GoFundMe money to Sunday Igbowo. The purpose of the donation is to get buses and provide an easy movement for Sunday Igbowo during its struggle to chase out the bad Fulani Hesme. But Dami Masha seems not to see it that way and even went as far as cursing those who are donating funds for the for Sunday Igbowo. And from what he tweeted, every he said every media establishment that repeatedly calls Sunday Igbowo a Yoruba activist is playing its part to cause ethnic crisis in the southwest in order to extract political value from it. Every one of them. I'm 100 percent Yoruba. But I will never support anyone that wants to cause war. The Igbo man is my brother. The Aosa man is my brother too. Case close. As a student of history, I know the cost of the last Ife Mudakeke crisis where this S Sunday Igbo was said to be an activist, active participant. All of those interview, interviewing him and amplifying the war is calling for, is calling for should be subjects of interest to the DSS. If the DSS still knows its duty, well, he said, uh, in my life I do not support nonsense. Go and read section 43 of the 1999 Constitution. One Nigeria, the country as a whole, belongs to all of us. After Dami Masha made this post, not quite long, Sunday Bo also rejected the GoFundMe money raised for them. Could Sunday Bo? Could Sunday Igbo the re rejection of the go for me money raised for him be as a result of what Dami Masha said? Hmm. Let's hear what people are saying concerning that. It's, it's, de it's deeper and deeper, deeper, deeper than that. If truly you, Dami Masha, study history with understanding, you know that Fulanese are not originally Nigeria. Re Nigerians, they came from Senegal and settled in Sokoto with Madame Fodio Holy Jihad, of which I'm sure history as a subject is being taken anymore. Because of this kind of truth, Dami Masha, you better apologize to Sunday Igbo before the blood of the of those kids by Fulani starts to fight you. Which history did the daughter of a Lucifer study? I'm a seasoned historian and I can tell you we have good historians who crave for genuine and holistic approaches to correct the wrongs of the past. Likewise, we have bad historians who wish to enrich their pockets at the expenses of revealing the true facts of events, thereby making negative narratives repeating themselves. I bet you she's only speaking for her father. Hmm. Which year history is she talking about? She's just a baby that knows nothing but being projected for political appointments. This one says now Olori Bruku Ibi Moke one of which your father command chief Sonic Bu. Okay. 
Uh, to me, Sonic Bobo is getting more matured. Also, he must have put on the, his thinking cap. If he accepts the money, it will surely amount to beginning of the end of him. As for as some of the donors and the onlookers will surely take him up on accountability and probity later. At the end of the day, he will be stained with corruption and mismanagement of fund. I don't know why you people value her stupidity by giving her recognition. She's just a kid, so just ignore her. <laughs> don't mind uh, the unserious lawyer. This guy is a betrayer like his father that betrayed an Ide barista. That's a, a qualm. One daughter must be very <laughs> reasonable. Okay, the godfather of his daddy is aiming presidency. Tell her which did she build even her father cannot say so. Dami, the, the daughter of K1, is, an, uh, is as pompous as the father. She's looking for cheap popularity. Sunday, Osa, you are not a pauper. You only have feelings for your helpless people. It's an ordinary and useless distraction. Um, this says no nothing. It's, it knows nothing about what makes a lawyer. Is her father money? Mudakeke and Ife, are you? Were you there? I'm there. I, mean, I was there. I was pressing. Okay, you fool because I'm not the kind of person you fool uh, because of your dream. We should stop uh, protecting our fatherland. We should, we should start to protect our fatherland. You are not a Yoruba. You are a selfish coward who know nothing about history and Nigeria. Did this one really study to become a lawyer or bought away? She's already digging a uh, for because the people will not forgive and forget her stupidity for a long time to come. Dami made the point Yoruba did not have a respect for their source. This is what has put many in trouble. Reki Lomodemo is as rich and popular of your father. How many use as he helps? I'm truly disappointed in this over pampered shawama brain and cheap recognition seeking daughter of someone i love so much bad daughter of a good father will let me see assume you less you're less exposed what i tell you if you if somebody someday somehow ever witness a core agony agonizing humiliation and dehumanization your mentality will change for life i don't blame you if Ulani s men they have dealt with you you would have known better the problem, all of them, I think all of them have, you might have a good point, but your presentation, if it's bad, it will rob you of all the points you are making. Like what a Fallon or said, Sue, he, 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 he was trying to, to come from one angle and he could not balance everything. But at the end of the day, he, he, he made a U-turn and he was just rigmaroling. So guys, let us hear your opinion that could this be the reason why Sunday Igbo had to stop the fund